Money Freedom, How to Brainwash Your Mind to Attract More Money Written by Kelvin W. Nathan Introduction Step into a reality where financial abundance flows effortlessly into your life. Money Freedom, How to Brainwash Your Mind to Attract More Money is your invitation to unlock the cosmic secrets of the universe and harness the power of your mind to manifest wealth and prosperity. In the boundless expanse of the universe, the mind emerges as a potent force capable of shaping our reality. This book transcends traditional financial advice, delving deep into the metaphysical principles that govern our relationship with money and abundance. Drawing inspiration from the cosmic dance of energy and consciousness, we'll explore practical techniques and spiritual insights to brainwash your mind and align with the universal flow of abundance. Imagine a world in which financial freedom is no longer a faraway fantasy, but a realistic reality within reach. Money Freedom offers a roadmap to this reality, empowering you to take control of your financial destiny through the transformative power of your mind. Follow us on this illuminating trip as we discover the secrets of the cosmos and harness its cosmic energy to bring more money into your life. Imagine if I told you that you could intentionally brainwash your mind to create a magnetic pull for wealth from the universe. Now, wouldn't you want to learn how to harness this potential power? For more information about the ebook version of this audio, visit audioboxoffice.com. We noticed that 78% of you who listen to our video are not yet subscribed to the channel. Please help support the channel by hitting the subscribe button and like the video. Thanks for inspiring us to create more content for you. Let's explore this intriguing and potentially life-changing process together, shall we? Part 1. The Money Freedom Attitude Start embracing the Money Freedom Attitude a powerful mindset that can transform your financial destiny and open the doors to unlimited wealth. This isn't some pie-in-the-sky dream, it's a reality that's within your reach. It's a mindset that allows you to see money not as a constraint, but a tool for growth and prosperity. It's understanding that you're the master of your wealth, not its servant. Now, you might be wondering, how can you cultivate that money freedom attitude? It starts with your mindset. You've got to ditch the negative thoughts about money. You've got to stop thinking that it's scarce or that it's the root of all evil. These are limiting beliefs that are holding you back. Instead, start seeing money as an abundant resource that you can attract and control. Next, you've got to embrace financial literacy. It's not enough to just want money, you've got to understand how it works. Invest time in learning about finances, about investments, and business. Knowledge is power, and in this case, it can be the key to your financial freedom. Part 2. The Power of the Universe Harnessing the power of the universe, you can set your intentions, attracting the abundance and wealth you desire. It's not mere fantasy. It's a process of aligning your thoughts and actions with the universe's limitless energy and potential. You're not alone in this journey. The universe, with its vast power and infinite possibilities, is your ally. It's imperative to recognize that the universe operates on a basis of energy and vibrations. Your thoughts and emotions emit frequencies, creating a ripple effect in the universe. If you constantly dwell on scarcity and lack, you'll attract more of the same. However, focusing on riches and prosperity aligns you with the universe's frequency of money. You've got to believe in your heart that you're deserving of wealth and prosperity. Don't just wish for it, envision it. Picture yourself living the affluent life you desire, feel the emotions associated with it, and let these images and feelings fuel your actions. You're not merely wishing upon a star, you're tapping into the universe's infinite pool of resources. Remember, the universe is responsive, not reactive. It mirrors your dominant thoughts and emotions. Therefore, it's crucial to maintain a positive, prosperous mindset. Your thoughts aren't just thoughts, they're powerful tools that shape your reality. And when you align these tools with the universe's expansive energy, you invite wealth and abundance into your life. 
Embrace the power of the universe. Believe in your worth, visualize your prosperity, and let the universe do its part. Your financial freedom is within reach, and the universe is ready to help you achieve it. Part 3. Attracting Money, A Basic Overview Now that you understand the universal energy and the power of your thoughts, let's explore the basic principles of attracting money into your life. Attracting money isn't about getting lucky, it's about aligning yourself with the energy of abundance. It's about turning your mind into a magnet for prosperity. The first step is to believe in abundance. The universe is infinitely abundant, and there's enough wealth for everyone. You're not taking away from anyone by attracting more money to yourself. You're simply tapping into the endless supply that's already available. Don't limit your beliefs to what you can see or touch. Just because you don't see it, doesn't mean it's not there. Trust in the abundance of the universe. Next, you need to be clear about what you want. The universe responds to specific requests. So, if you want more money, how much do you want? When do you want it by? What do you do with it? Be clear, be specific, and be bold. Part 4. Shifting Your Money Mindset To shift your money mindset, you need to first dismantle any negative beliefs about money that you've been carrying around. You might think that money is the root of all evil or that you can't be rich and a good person at the same time. These beliefs aren't only false, but they're also holding you back from achieving financial freedom. Start by challenging these negative thoughts every time they pop into your head. Ask yourself, is this really true? More often than not, you'll find that it isn't. You can be wealthy and kind, generous and humble. Money is just a tool, and like any tool, it can be used for good or ill. The choice is yours. Next, replace those negative beliefs with positive affirmations. I am capable of creating financial abundance. Money flows to me easily and effortlessly. I use money to make a positive impact in the world. These statements not only shift your mindset but also help you to start believing in your ability to attract and manage wealth. Part 5. The Law of Attraction Understanding the law of attraction can be a game-changer in your financial journey, as it's all about attracting whatever you focus on and believe in with absolute certainty. Think of your mind as a powerful magnet, drawing in the exact circumstances, people, and resources that align with your thoughts and emotions. The law isn't picky, it works with the positive and negative alike. So if you constantly worry about debt, you're inadvertently attracting more of it. But here's the good news. You can harness the law of attraction to improve your financial situation. Start by visualizing your financial goals with absolute clarity. Imagine yourself living the life you desire, free from financial stress. Feel the relief, the joy, and the immense satisfaction that comes with financial freedom. Picture it so vividly that it feels real. This isn't just daydreaming, it's a crucial step in manifesting your financial reality. The next step is to align your actions with your vision. If you're dreaming of a debt-free life, start by making a plan to pay off your debts. If you envision a hefty savings account, start saving, even if it's just a small amount initially. Remember, your actions create energy that the universe responds to. Lastly, maintain a positive mindset. Believe that you're deserving of wealth and abundance. Show thankfulness for what you already have and believe that the universe will provide what you require. It's a journey, but with the law of attraction on your side, you're well on your way to financial freedom. Part 6. Breaking Down Financial Beliefs Have you ever stopped to consider the deeply ingrained beliefs about money that might be holding you back from achieving your financial goals? These beliefs, often formed in childhood, can act as barriers, keeping you from the financial freedom you desire. It's essential to identify and challenge these beliefs. You might believe that money is the source of all evil, or that wealthy people are greedy. 
These beliefs can subconsciously influence your actions and decisions, making you avoid wealth for fear of becoming evil or greedy. Let's break it down. Money itself isn't evil, and being rich doesn't make you greedy. Money is a tool, a resource that can be used for good or ill, depending on the person wielding it. Instead of viewing money negatively, consider the positive impact it could have. Imagine being able to support your family, donate to charities, or fund your dream project. You might also believe that money doesn't grow on trees or that you have to work hard to earn money. While it's true that money requires effort to earn, it doesn't mean you have to struggle or suffer. Many people create wealth through smart investments, passive income, or by doing what they love. Start breaking down these financial beliefs, question their validity, and challenge them. You'll soon realize they're not absolute truths but limiting beliefs holding you back. By doing so, you're paving the way to financial freedom and opening the door to attract more money from the universe. Part 7. Reprogramming Your Money Mind Let's dive right into reshaping your mental landscape about money, an essential step in paving your path to financial abundance. You've got to understand that your current financial status is a reflection of your deep-seated beliefs about money. If you're not where you want to be financially, it's time to change your mind about money. Start by examining your beliefs. Identify any negative or limiting thoughts you have about money. Do you see it as evil or believe it's only for the wealthy? These are limiting beliefs that could be holding you back. Once you've identified these beliefs, it's time to replace them with empowering ones. Instead of thinking, I can't afford that, think, how can I afford that? This shifts your mindset from a place of lack to a place of possibility. Instead of believing that money is the root of all evil, understand that money is a tool that can create opportunities and improve lives. Next, it's crucial to affirm your new beliefs daily. Speak to yourself positively about money. Say things like, I am a money magnet, or, money flows effortlessly to me. Feel the emotional resonance of these affirmations. The aim is to deeply ingrain these beliefs in your subconscious, creating a positive money mindset that will attract wealth into your life. Part 8. Visualization Techniques for Wealth Building on your newly formed positive beliefs about money, visualization techniques can serve as powerful tools to manifest wealth in your life. Picture yourself living your dream life with all the financial freedom you desire. See it feel it, and believe it. Visualization is more than just daydreaming. It's a deliberate and intentional practice that trains your brain to see your financial goals as achievable. This isn't something mystical or out of reach. Neuroscientists affirm that the brain doesn't differentiate between real and imagined experiences. So, when you visualize wealth, your brain perceives that as your reality. To maximize the effectiveness of your visualization, try to engage all your senses. Imagine the smell of new money or the sound of a bank alert notifying you of a hefty deposit. Feel the texture of luxurious items you'd buy or the joy of providing for your loved ones without strain. Importantly, consistency is key. Make it a daily habit. Dedicate a few minutes each day to visualize your wealthy life. Remember, just like with any new habit, it might feel odd at first, but with time and practice, it'll become second nature. Moreover, don't just focus on the end result, visualize the journey too. Imagine yourself making smart financial decisions, investing wisely, and seeing your wealth grow. This process reinforces your belief in your ability to create wealth. Part 9 Manifesting money, the process. Now that you're consistently visualizing wealth, it's time to understand how to actively manifest money into your life. It's not magic, it's a process. A process that requires belief, action, and persistence. Start by setting clear financial goals. Be specific. Don't just say, I want to be rich. 
Instead, define what that means to you. Perhaps it's earning a certain amount each year, saving enough for retirement, or being debt-free. Write these goals down, make them tangible. They become the blueprint of your financial destiny. Next, you need to align your thoughts and emotions with these goals. You've already started this through visualization. Now, it's time to delve deeper. Train your mind to not just picture wealth, but to believe in it. Convince yourself that you're not just deserving of wealth, but that it's already yours. This is the law of attraction in action. Then, move on to action. Dreams and beliefs are powerful, but they're not enough on their own. You need to work towards your goals. This isn't just about working harder, but smarter. Seek opportunities, make wise decisions, and don't shy away from challenges. Each step you take brings you closer to your financial goals. Part 10. The Role of Gratitude In the journey towards financial abundance, practicing gratitude plays a critical role, acting as the catalyst that fuels your belief system and propels you closer to your goals. You see, gratitude isn't just about saying thanks, it's an essential mindset that transforms your relationship with money and abundance. Think about it. When you're grateful, you're acknowledging the abundance that already exists in your life. This mindset shifts your emphasis away from what you lack and onto what you have, resulting in a positive feedback loop that attracts more wealth. As you appreciate what you have, you'll begin to notice more opportunities for wealth creation around you. But how do you cultivate this attitude of gratitude? It's simple. Start by listing the things you're thankful for every day. They don't have to be money-related. They could be as basic as a tasty dinner, a kind gesture from a stranger, or a breathtaking sunset. As you do this, you're rewiring your brain to recognize and appreciate abundance. Always keep in mind that the universe responds to the energy you send out. When you express gratitude, you're sending a powerful message to the universe that you're ready for more abundance. This isn't some magic trick, it's a principle grounded in the laws of attraction. Gratitude is the secret sauce to attracting wealth. It's the key that unlocks the door to unlimited abundance. It's the spark that lights the path towards your financial freedom. So make appreciation a daily practice and see how it affects your life. Part 11. Vital Affirmations for Wealth Just as gratitude paves the way for abundance, positive affirmations for wealth can significantly enhance your financial mindset, shifting your focus towards prosperity and success. These affirmations aren't just feel-good phrases, they're powerful tools that can reprogram your subconscious mind, helping you to believe in your ability to attract and manage wealth. Consider this. You're constantly talking to yourself, aren't you? Whether you're aware of it or not, you're always feeding your mind with thoughts and beliefs, and these shape your reality. If you're continually telling yourself that money is hard to come by, guess what? It will be. But if you affirm your wealth, abundance, and prosperity, you'll start attracting these into your life. You may be thinking, but I've never been rich, how can I affirm something that's not true? That's where the power of affirmations comes in. You're not lying to yourself, you're presenting a new reality to your subconscious mind, one where you're prosperous and successful. And the more you affirm this, the more your mind starts believing it, and the more your actions align with this belief. Start your day with affirmations like, I am a magnet for money, wealth flows to me easily and abundantly, and, I am financially free. Repeat these phrases throughout the day, especially when doubts and fears creep in. You're not just saying these words, you're programming your mind for wealth. Part 12. Money Attraction Through Meditation While affirmations can powerfully reprogram your mind for wealth, incorporating a meditation practice can further enhance your ability to attract money. Meditation helps to clear your mind of negativity and fear, two significant barriers to wealth manifestation. It's a powerful tool that allows you to access your subconscious mind and align your thoughts and desires with the universe's abundance. 
Start with daily meditation sessions, preferably in the morning when your mind is fresh and receptive. Find a quiet and comfortable space where you won't be disturbed. Sit comfortably, close your eyes, and begin to focus on your breath. As you breathe in, imagine wealth and abundance flowing into your life, and as you breathe out, visualize letting go of any financial worries or limitations. Now, to enhance the process, add money mantras to your meditation. These are positive affirmations specifically designed to attract wealth. Phrases such as, I am a money magnet, or, wealth comes effortlessly to me, can be quite helpful. Repeat these mantras mentally as you meditate, truly believing in their power. Remember, it's not just about the words, but the feelings behind them. Feel the joy of financial freedom, the comfort of having more than enough money, the satisfaction of being able to help others. This emotional connection will amplify your money-attracting vibrations. Incorporating meditation into your wealth manifestation routine isn't just effective, it's also therapeutic. It reduces stress, improves focus, and promotes overall well-being. So, start meditating for money today, and watch the universe respond to your call. Part 13. Harnessing Cosmic Energy Harnessing cosmic energy, you can turbocharge your efforts towards attracting wealth and prosperity. This universal energy is abundant, ever-present, and available to anyone willing to tap into it. It's not some highbrow, mystical concept. It's real, it's practical, and it's a game-changer in your journey towards financial freedom. Imagine the universe as a vast ocean of energy. Floating within it, you're like a magnet attracting what you focus on. To draw more money into your life, you need to align yourself with the energy of abundance. That's where harnessing cosmic energy comes in. This doesn't mean you'll find a pot of gold at the end of a rainbow. No, this is about realigning your energy to match that of the universe's abundance. It's about letting go of scarcity mindset and embracing the truth that there's more than enough for everyone. Part 14. Consistent Thought Patterns In the pursuit of financial prosperity, maintaining consistent thought patterns is as vital as breathing. Your mind is a powerful instrument, and your thoughts create your reality. Through this power, you can manifest wealth and abundance if you focus your thoughts correctly. Remember, you're not just thinking about money. You're building a relationship with it. You're understanding its value, its potential, and its role in your life. Keep your thoughts about money positive, balanced, and beneficial to your overall well-being. It's not about greed or materialism, it's about security, freedom, and opportunity. Consistency is key. You can't expect to think positively about money for a day and have the universe shower you with wealth. You need to maintain this thought pattern, day in and day out, regardless of your current financial situation. It's a process, and it takes time, patience, and perseverance. Think of your mind as a garden. If you plant seeds of prosperity and water them daily with positive thoughts, they'll grow into a reality of abundance. However, if you allow weeds of negativity to take over, they'll choke out your prosperity. Part 15. Physical Actions for Money Magnetism You're ready to take the next step, aligning your physical actions with your positive mindset to truly become a magnet for money. This isn't about some mystical energy or secret formula, it's about embodying the belief that you're deserving of wealth and that the universe is ready to provide it. Start by embracing a lifestyle that reflects financial prosperity. This doesn't mean splurging on luxuries you can't afford, but rather presenting yourself as someone who values their worth. Dress well, maintain good hygiene, and take care of your health. These actions signal to the universe that you're ready for wealth. Invest time in growing your skills and knowledge. The more you know, the more you're worth. Participate in seminars, read books, and take online courses. This won't only boost your confidence but also increase your value in the marketplace. Next, surround yourself with successful people who inspire you. 
Their positive energy and success stories can motivate you to aim higher. They'll also provide valuable insights and opportunities that can lead to your financial growth. Lastly, practice generosity. The universe operates on the law of reciprocity. The more you give, the more you receive. It's not just about money, but also time, effort, and kindness. By doing so, you're creating a flow of positive energy that attracts abundance. Part 16. Letting go of financial fear. Despite the strides you've made, if you're still holding onto financial fear, it's time to let it go, because it's only creating a barrier between you and the wealth you deserve. Understand that fear is nothing more than a state of mind, a negative energy that you're unknowingly inviting into your life. It's not real. It's a creation of your mind that's keeping you from realizing your full potential. How do you let go of this fear? The answer is simple, face it head on. Identify what exactly is making you afraid. Is it a fear of failure? A fear of not having enough? Once you've pinpointed the root of your fear, confront it. Ask yourself, what's the worst that could happen? You'll likely find that even your worst-case scenario isn't as catastrophic as you've imagined. Next, adopt a positive mindset. Stop seeing money as an enemy or a looming threat. Instead, view it as a tool, a resource that you can leverage to create the life you desire. Remember, money isn't the root of all evil. It's the love of money that can lead to difficulties. Lastly, embrace the process. Every person who's achieved financial freedom has faced their share of obstacles. You're not alone. It's part of the journey. So, let go of your financial fear, embrace the challenges, and watch as the universe rewards your bravery with abundance. Part 17. Cultivating an Abundance Mentality To truly attract wealth, it's vital that you cultivate an abundance mentality, seeing the world as overflowing with opportunities rather than limitations. Don't allow scarcity thoughts to cloud your vision, instead, push yourself to see the wealth of possibilities that exist around you. Think about it this way, it's not that opportunities aren't present, but rather your mindset may be preventing you from identifying them. You're not looking for a single golden ticket, you're looking for a world filled with golden opportunities, and they're there, waiting for you to seize them. Your thoughts have power, and by focusing on abundance, you're programming your mind to attract wealth. The universe responds to your ideas and emotions, so fill them with optimism and belief in your abilities to attract money. This isn't just about wishful thinking, it's about truly believing in the wealth of opportunities available to you. But how can you cultivate this abundance mentality? Start by celebrating others' success instead of feeling envious or threatened. Embrace the belief that there's enough for everyone. Practice gratitude for what you already have, because appreciation attracts more of what you value. And remember, money isn't the sole indicator of abundance. Time, love, health, and knowledge are also forms of wealth that you can attract. Part 18. Practicing Money Mindfulness In addition to embracing the abundance mentality, it's also crucial to practice money mindfulness, a focused awareness of your financial habits and attitudes. This isn't about obsessing over every penny spent, but rather understanding your money flow and respecting its value. You see, money mindfulness is about being fully present in your financial life. It's about recognizing your financial decisions in real time, understanding their impact, and making conscious choices. This might sound simple, but it's a practice that demands your attention and discipline. Now, how can you start? Begin by tracking your income and expenses. Understand where every dollar is coming from and where it's going. This gives you a clear picture of your financial reality. It's about facing the truth, no matter how uncomfortable it might be. Next, pay attention to your money emotions. Do you feel anxiety or joy when you think about money? Your emotions can tell you a lot about your money mindset. 
They can reveal hidden beliefs that might be holding you back from attracting more money into your life. Lastly, make mindful spending decisions. Before you make a purchase, pause and ask yourself, is this purchase aligning with my financial goals? Is it bringing value to my life? This simple act can help you avoid unnecessary expenses and keep your money in alignment with your values. Part 19. Financial Self-Love and Respect Just as you nourish your body and mind with self-love and respect, it's equally vital to extend the same kindness to your finances. Financial self-love isn't about obsessing over money. It's about recognizing your financial worth and taking steps to preserve and enhance it. It's about asserting your right to financial security and prosperity. Don't let negative thoughts or past financial mistakes hinder your progress. Everyone has financial ups and downs. What truly matters is how you react to these events. A critical component of financial self-love is forgiving yourself for those mistakes and learning from them. Your financial self-respect isn't defined by your bank balance. It's about how you manage what you've got. Are you living within your means, saving for the future, and making informed decisions? It's your actions, not your account balance, that truly demonstrate financial self-respect. In the world of finance, knowledge is power. Learn more about money management, investing, and financial planning. The more you understand, the better choices you'll make. You're not only investing in your financial future, but also showing respect for your hard-earned money. Part 20. Embracing Wealth in Life Once you've nurtured a mindset of financial self-love and respect, you're ready to fully embrace wealth in your life. Embracing wealth isn't about frivolous spending or hoarding money, it's about understanding the value and potential of money. It is about viewing money as a tool, a resource that may help you achieve your objectives and live a fulfilled life. Imagine wealth as a friend. You don't use or abuse friends, right? Instead, you respect them, cherish their presence, and see them as valuable additions to your life. That's how you should treat wealth. It's not something to be feared or despised, but something to be appreciated and utilized effectively. Remember, the universe is abundant. There's enough wealth for everyone. Don't let thoughts of scarcity or competition cloud your mindset. Instead, focus on attracting and maintaining wealth. Believe in your ability to create wealth and have faith in the universe's ability to provide it. Affirmations can be particularly useful here. Regularly remind yourself that you're worthy of wealth, that you have the ability to attract it, and that it's coming to you. Visualizations can also be helpful. Imagine yourself living a life of abundance. Picture the wealth you desire and believe that it's already yours. Embracing wealth in your life is about more than just money, it's about embracing a mindset of abundance and prosperity. It's about believing in your worth and in the universe's ability to provide. So, go ahead and fully embrace wealth in your life. You deserve it. Part 21. Monitoring your financial progress. As you journey towards financial abundance, it's essential to keep track of your progress, applauding each milestone and adjusting your strategies as needed. Monitoring your financial progress isn't merely about numbers. It's about understanding your relationship with money, recognizing patterns, and making informed decisions that gear you towards your financial goals. You need to be proactive in this process. Set tangible goals and track your progress. Don't just look at your bank statements. Look deeper. How are your investments performing? Are you sticking to your budget? Are you reducing debt? These key indicators will tell you if you're on the right path. Don't be disheartened if you stumble. It's all part of the journey. Remember, it's not about perfection but about progression. If you find that you're not making as much progress as you'd like, don't beat yourself up. Instead, reassess your strategies. 
Perhaps you need to adjust your spending habits or explore new investment opportunities. Keep your eyes on the prize and maintain a positive mindset. Consistency is key. Make it a habit to regularly review your financial progress. This isn't a one-time task, but a continual process that requires your attention and effort. The more you comprehend about your financial situation, the better prepared you will be to make decisions that bring you closer to independence from money. Part 22. Celebrating Monetary Successes In your journey to financial freedom, it's crucial to take time to celebrate your monetary successes, no matter how small they may seem. Each milestone, from saving your first $100 to paying off a credit card, deserves recognition. These victories, while they may look insignificant, are stepping stones towards your ultimate financial destination. By celebrating them, you're reinforcing your progress, boosting your confidence, and increasing your motivation to continue. Think of it like this, each of your monetary achievements is a building block in your financial fortress. By acknowledging and celebrating each of these blocks, you're recognizing the strength and stability they're adding to your fortress. This process won't only motivate you but also make you more attuned to opportunities that could further enhance your financial status. Moreover, celebrating your successes helps to reinforce the positive habits that got you there. It's a psychological pat on the back that says, you're on the right track. Keep going. This kind of mental reinforcement is crucial in developing financial discipline and resilience. So, you're ready to embrace wealth, aren't you? Now, take a deep breath and embark on this wonderful path to financial freedom. Remember, it's your mindset that sets the stage. Believe in the universe's power, and let the law of attraction work its magic. Celebrate every dollar earned, every financial milestone crossed. Keep your eyes on the prize, and watch as the universe showers you with abundance. Your money freedom is just a mindset shift away. Thanks for listening to or reading this from Audiobooks Office.